Slab. Oh hey there! Have you seen one of these before? It's called a magnet and they're really fun to play with. A magnet is an object that can pull certain types of metal. It has magnetic force. Magnetic force is a non-contact force. It works over a distance. A magnet does not need to be touching the object it pulls. Check this out. Wow! Did you see that? The magnet pulled the paper clips through the air. A magnet can attract objects that are made of magnetic materials. This means that the metal iron in these paper clips must be a magnetic material. Objects made of or containing iron will be attracted to magnets. Let's test it out. One of these objects is made of iron. Can you take a guess at which one? We have a coin, a key, a gold ring and a nail. Let's test it out. Not the coin. The coin is made of copper and nickel metals. I guess they're not magnetic. Let's try the key. Nope, not the key. The key is made of aluminium. I guess that's not magnetic either. Let's try the gold ring. Nope, the gold ring isn't attracted to our magnet. Let's try the nail. Yes, the nail is attracted to the magnet. The nail is made of iron, which is a magnetic material. Hmm, I wonder if magnets are attracted to other magnets. Let's test and see. A magnet has a north and a south pole. Let's try bringing the two north poles together and see what happens. Cool! Did you see that? The North Poles repelled each other. I bet the same thing happens with the South Poles. Let's test and see. Yes! The South Poles also pushed each other away. Poles that are the same push each other away. Like poles repel. What do you think will happen when we place opposite poles of the magnets together? Just as I suspected, they attract. Opposite poles attract. I hope you had as much fun as I did today learning about magnets. See you next time!